A karmic partner has been spending a lot of money on readings or spiritualists to attempt dark magic work to control, bind, or block a union. The worlds, because they know the cycle is over. They know you guys are going towards this door, opening up a new doorway. You guys are taking the steps towards this connection or reconciling a connection. So, me all, this is a whole new person you're starting a new chapter with. They're getting bad karma. The more and more they keep playing with some spell work or paying somebody, it's just going to keep just racking up karmic debt. King of Wands. They're doing this over a masculine energy or divine masculine. It's because this person's down. This person's no longer under their control or no longer binded up. They lost control over this person. They could have had magic over this person for a very long time to where they didn't realize this or couldn't see things for what they were. Ten of swords reversed. This was destined to happen. This person was meant to break free. Five of Wands. It was trying to hold this person captive. If this is somebody that was married a long time or something like that, or together for a long time, this was only because of magic. Three of Coins reverse. They are um, doing this dark stuff because they're trying to get somebody to have some kind of conflict, or they're trying to get you guys to fight and break up. I keep seeing these conflict spells out. Five of Swords reverse. They could have attempted to try to get you guys to fight recently. Knight of Swords. Two of Coins reverse. It looks like you guys found out the truth. Someone's been finding out the truth or they know about some kind of spells or spell work or they've been researching it. You guys could have spoke out about this. You guys could have told this person you knew about some kind of spell work. They could have been um, putting stuff in your guys' food and your drinks. You guys could have found about that, found out about that and said something about that. I'm seeing somebody spoke out about something, some kind of truth. Nine of Cups reversed. So basically they're trying to regain control, but this is done with this world energy, the Saturn energy. Saturn's getting ready to transit too, and so is Pluto. Those are really big. Um, Pluto death, yeah, that's Pluto. Pluto's getting ready to transit into Aquarius for the next 20 years. Yeah, and then the world of Saturn, and then Saturn, as we've been discussing, is gonna be going into Pisces for, um, I believe, the next two and a half, three years. So, so there's Pluto and then there's Pisces which is the 12th house so this is just endings you guys may be seeing a lot of people die and pass away or a lot of marriages ending um, there's going to be a lot of serious endings this is uh, totally unavoidable they're just hurting themselves fighting us off What do they say? The more you resist, the more it persists. Okay, show me some karmic partner. They're spending a lot of money on readings or on spiritualists to attempt dark magic. They are really stressed out and restless. They're unhappy and miserable. 
They could have a hard time concentrating. They could have sent somebody some kind of message, message in a bottle. This person could just um, be all in the bottle, drinking a lot and stuff. This person is real toxic and bad health right now. TikTok, someone, this is sad. I keep seeing someone's getting ready to pass away. That could be part of their bad karma. This karma could definitely be getting ready to pass away. Especially if, yeah. This was a false marriage or false relationship. All that glitters is not gold. Whatever this is, is getting torn down. It was all a facade. If this person's doing some kind of death spells or trying to kill somebody or take somebody out, they, yeah. Show me more about this karmic doing this dark magic or paying somebody. Because they got left out in the cold or they're in poverty now. Change. You could have changed or the situation is ending, coming to a change or somebody's moving out. They're stressing out, trying to figure out how they can get you guys to fight. Community. Child. There could be something about a child here. Judication. Something was revealed to a masculine energy. Something about a child. Four swords reverse. They're going crazy and doing some kind of spell work or something. Yeah, they are. This is confirmation. You guys look like you guys already know this. Show me this death reverse. Star reverse. This is hopeless. There's this is not gonna be there is like negative ten thousand percent chance that this person is gonna be able to repair whatever this is. This cannot come back to life, whatever they're trying to get back to life. I've seen a masculine energy that already closed the door. You guys could have moved on years ago or something like that. Show me this five of wands. This looks like conflict spells or something. Yeah, someone's trying to get you guys to fight or argue and then have the law get involved. They're hoping that somebody calls the police. Whoever's in love, they're trying to get you guys to fight. Some man is in love with somebody or some masculine energies in love. This could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So basically they're trying to have somebody arrested or something. Yeah, these are conflict spells. Five of Wands, Page of Wands, Reverse, Hanged Man, Reverse. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Five of Wands, Reverse. Yeah, they're just, this is their own conflict with themselves. They're fighting their own inner battle or inner demons. Ace of Cups, Reverse. They're waiting for somebody to get arrested. And so what happens if the person that they're trying to get back gets arrested? What happens if this this person, I should be this king of cups. What happens if this person gets arrested? They're just imagining and banking on somebody else that they're competing with to get arrested what if the person that they're chasing after or doing all this after whoever they're trying to control or bind what happens if they get locked up in jail so they didn't really they wouldn't have been accomplishing anything they're not thinking they're not even thinking like that they're not even thinking like what if this doesn't work what if this doesn't work out of my favor what if that person gets locked away Page of Pentacles reverse. They're just playing with stuff they don't know nothing about. They could just be paying somebody. Oh, this is terrible. They're spending their last little dime on some spell work that's not working. This person's got to be psychotic or something. They do this consistently. This is why this is always coming out. It's 
that's all there is to do. Simply move on. Show me this Five of Cups. It's like wishful thinking. They're praying and wishing you guys are going to fight. That's so unrealistic. They could be on drugs or something like that or drink a lot. Judgment reversed. They can't, they can't even deal with their own karma. This energy can't even handle and deal with their own karma. They can't even face their own judgment. They're in denial. They could be in denial about a child. A long way. Something about a long way in child. Somebody could have been abusing the child for a long time or trying to kill a child for a long time. Bereavement. There's a Grim Reaper right there. This is done. What are they trying to do with regards to a child? They could be upset about a child or try to blame somebody else. I'm picking up on an energy. Somebody's mad because you found out the child is yours. What are they trying to do with regards to a child? Are they doing magic over a child? Two of Cups reverse, Four of Swords. They feel like somebody's healing or something or some kind of recovery. Or what is this magic they're doing? What is this with a child? Is this magic? Nine of Wands. They could be trying to block out a child or trying to get you blocked off from your kids. Somebody is Seven of Swords reverse. You guys could have caught them doing this or realized this. They're trying to um, come in between somebody and keep you like totally isolated, blocked off from them or not having any type of access or not being able to talk to them. They could have did this something with court adjudication is here. Child. Yeah, you got a child with somebody else or something like that. You chose a child. Page of one. Some of y'all, this is a son. The hanged man. This could be a Gemini or a Pisces. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Seven of Cups. Um, somebody could have been trying to confuse you about a child. Some of y'all are waiting on a child. Something with a child they're trying to um, block off. What is this adjudication? What is this community? Two of Pentacles. King of Coins reverse. This could be somebody that was cheating or um, juggling somebody. Um, having side pieces. You could have been helping somebody live in a community paying somebody to live in some kind of community you stop being generous or something like that or committed to something somebody was living off of you or um some kind of gold digger energy it feels like this is a gold digger doing spell work it's like a gold digger type of energy someone codependent tower they're trying to fight off a tower Tell me more about a community. Because I just seen in the last reading, somebody was getting ready to move up out of a community. This may be that. Yeah, the chariot. They can't afford to live in this community without somebody, so they're doing spell work over them. That's just confirmation. Somebody broke up or they're getting ready to. Some of you guys were... Um, paying for other people's kids or other people's children. Um, some of you guys could have found out that some kid wasn't yours. I'm seeing a lot of different things. Ace of Wands, Eight of Wands. Yeah. They have to move. There's no other way out. They got to move forward in some way, shape, or form. They got to get out of that community. Whoever's doing a spell work or they're paying for this is going to fly. It's literally, I'm seeing right now, it's literally about to fly back to them. Something about pets. Some of you guys could have two pets. 
divorce. There's a divorce on the horizon. It's very close. There's some experience in a breakup, a divorce or a um, breakup. Some of you guys have already broken up or divorced. There's a movement though. So they're trying to hide this or something. They're trying to be sneaky about it. They could be trying to um, cover this up. They're trying to cover their tracks. Someone's trying to cover up some truth or something. Liar. They could be calling um, somebody that told the truth or is telling the truth. They're trying to call them a liar. They don't want somebody to know something about a divorce or breakup. Yeah, this is a divorce. Ten of coins reversed. They can't afford this house no more or something. Wherever they're living at, apartment. They gotta move. Nobody's ain't nobody lying. This person's gotta move. Nobody's lying. Their family is broken up or split up or their marriage is over. Is this person just that in denial about what's going on or what? It looks like it. They keep trying to control a masculine or emperor. No spell work is going to stop this. They just got to move. This always is becoming out. 